How you feeling after that one? <laughs> Not really good. I feel my legs is heavy. I hope it's gonna be, if I qualify for Friday and then I hope it's gonna be ready. But I feel kind of my legs are heavy for some reason. But if I can maybe it's a workout, I'm not sure. Yeah. yeah. Did you did you feel that before the race or only during the race? Uh, yeah, I kind of feel tired and heavy. Like I'm not really quite feeling it. Like I used to feel it in London. So yeah, it's just one of those days. I hope I qualify today, 19. So yeah. yeah. I mean, how t you think that time will hold up? Or you think the time will hold up? That's still fairly fast. Yeah, I, a 19 is still fast. So let's wait and see these guys what they're gonna do. Yeah. If they run faster than that, then. Maybe I don't, maybe I will, so I'm not sure yet. How you handle, I mean, it's been a long year for everyone. How is yeah, your body feeling right now? I'm just tired. Yeah. Like my legs are just done. Yeah, I'm just ready to go home. Yeah. yeah. What was your reaction to the Alberto Salazar news? To the Salazar news? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> really, I don't know anything to do with Salazar apart from the allegations that have been made a lot. Are you so, surprised? Um, if what they find out is true, then it's good for our sport. Uh, we shouldn't be having coaches like those, you know, you know, a track and field. So um, I think the USADA and the why are they taking the good initiative to make sure that we're having a clean sport so that when we come here, we compete equally. Instead of seeing people taking medals and then five years later you just hear that this had something on and then the, the, the number four, five, six guys are losing. So, you, you know, we're all for clean sport. That's what I can say. Yeah. Thanks, Stanley. Thanks, Stanley.